What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another Wednesday video. We're back again. We're in the kitchen. I got my special interviewee today. It's Nicholas Diaz, Nick, Nicky D, the Nick, the Nick, it's Nick. Um, Let's go. What are we cooking today, Nick? Oh, we're making homemade pizza bites. I, I'm ready. Homemade pizza rolls, guys. Looking forward to it. I got all my supplies here. Um, again, the COVID situation is still happening, so we got Nick on FaceTime. Um, but let's just dive in. <laughs> Alright guys, so first things first, we want to go and set the oven to 425 degrees so that, that gets cooking. Idiot, obviously. Alright. 425, I feel like that's a weird number. I've never cooked anything at 425 degrees. I'm going to get a 420. That's the magic number, baby. Why? Because that's the David Dobrik's vlogs? Yeah, that's why. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead and open up this flour. We got a different flour than the one in the last video, if any of you guys saw the last video. We had some organic flour. Today, I'm at my home, so I got some real flour, baby. Where were you last time? Uh, we were at my grandparents' home. Oh. Yeah, we were supposed to film there today, but apparently my family's going over there for dinner, and so that did not work out. That makes sense. All right, so I need to dust this. How, do I, how much should I put, like that much? Ooh, yeah. You should heavily dust it. Heavily? Uh, yeah. I'm gonna really mad. I'm gonna make a mess. All right, more. Ooh, I'm wearing black pants. I didn't think this through. Idiot. I need to get an apron, y'all. That's how like Domino's gets their pizza like extra like dusty. Really? They just... Isn't it like flour? Yeah. yeah. This feels really cool. I've never like played with flour like this. I'm All right. Just gonna put it there. All right, Nick. Let's get right into these questions here. Walk me through a day of Nicholas Diaz. Like, what do you do in a day? Let's do Corona um, edition. Okay, I was gonna say, well, oh, well, that's the more boring one. All right, well then, give me the give me the lively one, whatever you think. Looks on you, they're both boring. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> corona edition. I wake up um, pretty early. I go on my phone. I text Viv. Um, I go on social media, and then after that, I go down. I skip breakfast though every day. I don't eat breakfast. Why? Um, I, cause I'm gonna eat lunch and I don't need breakfast and then lunch. Like I already wake up at like nine, ten. Like I have to wait the two hours for lunch. Don't eat lunch. Eat breakfast and then dinner. No, I don't like. I don't like. I would rather eat lunch than breakfast. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Pause. I'm so sorry. Pretty cool. I like that. Look at this. I thought it'd be like rolled up more, but that's really cool. So all of the pizza stuff is out. So I bought this. It's like not Pillsbury. This is the only thing that they had. Um, oh. it's. I don't know, it's Wawaka, I don't know how to say this brand, I'm so sorry. But it's like this big giant thing of dough, and it's already like out. I've never like made any type of pizza ever, so I don't know how it normally is. But look at this. It up like that. Oh, it comes apart really easy, okay. All right, so, okay, go on. So you wake up, you don't eat breakfast, you just eat lunch. <laughs> it was already rolled out for you. I want to do the fun part. <laughs> Right, uh, um, so I, I skip breakfast, um, and then usually I start making my lunch around like 11.30, 11.45, um, and then I'll eat that, I'll watch some Netflix um, while I eat my lunch till maybe around like 1. What are you watching on Netflix right now? Uh, right now I'm watching Shit's Creek. I'm sorry? Shit's Creek, it's a Canadian show. Interesting, okay. Yeah, it's, it's really weird, and my sister told me to watch it. But it, I, I find it funny, but it's a weird show. Like, I, I, I don't know why I find it funny, but it's funny. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm watching that right now. Um, and then after that, I'll probably... I'm taking a shower every other day, because I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going to take a shower every day. Right. Yeah. And so, um, you know, sometimes I'll take a shower. I'm going to take my dog for a walk. Um, I have, I'm, I'm trying to watch a lot of movies because I have like a list I want to get done, so I've been watching some movies. Right. Um, and, and, but that's about it. I'm really absolutely doing nothing with my life. So it's not much normal from like normal, uh, non-COVID yeah, days. Yeah, my normal life would be everything except at like 1.30 I have to go to work and that's it. Right. Yeah, that's my normal life. Sounds like an interesting day. Bro, I broke this pizza. Yeah, I told you not to mash it up. I don't know how to make it better. Do you have a rolling pin? No. Nice. Alright, we got our dough back together. Let's go and roll this bad boy out into a big long thing like it originally was because I'm a dummy. Um, but in the meantime, Nick, when I'd asked you to tell me about your like a day in the life of Nicholas, you mentioned Vivian, who's Viv. 
Oh, Viv is my girlfriend. She's been on your channel before. Yes, she has. Yeah. Um, we've been um, FaceTiming and finding other ways to keep ourselves busy during this boring time. That's fun. Uh, we, we made Club Penguin accounts, so that's pretty fun. Ooh. Nicoletta yeah. wants me to make a Webkins account. Apparently they're giving away, like, there's, like, free Webkins that you can make now. That's really fun. Yeah. So I might do that. You should. It's fun. I've been um, play, playing the, the, the karate game on Club Penguin. That's my favorite thing in the world. I've honestly spent two hours on that. What belt level are you? I'm only, um, I'm only the brown. Okay. I think. Can't remember. How long have you and Viv been together? Oh, we've been together a year and two months. Aw, no, that's cute. Three months. Oh my gosh. It's wow. the 11th. Time flies. And it doesn't, it doesn't it ever. What is your favorite thing about yours and Viv's relationship? Hmm. Um, I like the way uh, that we, like, talk to each other. I think it's really, I think we have a really good, um, like, open communication about us. I think it's really nice. And I think that we talk about anything and everything. I think it's nice. No, we talk really well to each other. I think we communicate really well. Nice. Alright, next we gotta season it. We gotta season this boy. We got some garlic salt and some Italian seasoning. So I don't, I'm not good at seasoning. I don't know how much seasoning to put on things. Oh, this isn't open. I just bought it to... Tasha, you season to taste. Oh, but see, that's what it says and I never understood. I thought it was like saying you're seasoning it because seasoning gives taste. But on... Um... No, you season it till you taste it and it's good. It's not something you like. Alright, that looks yeah. good to me. Yeah. Just a light sprinkle should be good. Yeah, a light sprinkle. Yeah. Yeah. All right, and then we need some garlic salt. Um, don't right. worry, Nick. I'll have you back on the show once it's not quarantine season. And then Nick and Nicoletta will both be on the show again, and they can actually help me make food. So maybe it'll come out better. Maybe it'll come out worse. Who knows? So next up, we're going to need to put on all the cheeses and the pepperonis. All right, Nick. So while we're doing that, right, we'll get some good pepperonis. If you could have a pseudonym, what would your name be? Uh, um, <laughs> um, well, under what context am I using the pseudonym? No, no, no. Um, say you become a famous author. Nathan. Nathan? Nathan. Okay, first name Nathan. Yeah, no real name for now. Nathan. Oh, yeah, I guess that's a good one. I guess I could say Nathan, like, Fernandez. Because I'm Hispanic, that, that, would, that would work. All right, Nathan Hernandez. Just to update you on how this pizza's going, um, terrible. I would say it's not great. <laughs> not good at all. <laughs> so the pepperoni slices are about as big as my pizza. <laughs> <laughs> great. Why don't you, um, kind of Well, they're already on there, and there's cheese everywhere, too. All right. <laughs> uh, Nick, if you got famous for something, what would it be for? Uh... Uh, I don't know. I have to roll this crust into a tight log now. Hot. Uh, Just wanted to keep you updated on what, what was going on. I would on. be famous for giving TED Talks. I could do that. Giving TED Talks? What would your TED Talks be about? Uh, well, see, I wouldn't, I wouldn't write them. I would just present them. Uh, do people not write the TED Talks that they present? Um, I think some do, but I feel like a lot of them... Um, like they're just from like an organization, right? I have no idea. I don't watch that many TED Talks, to be honest. Yeah. All right, so to update, we've got our tight, really rolled log. Look at this beauty. Wow. It's it's kind of falling apart on us, so we got to get this into the oven ASAP. Well, there's definitely like extra dough on the side. Yeah, no, there definitely is. And there's also definitely like holes within the dough, too. Also, make sure now that it's rolled up, to put extra seasoning on top, the garlic and the Italian seasoning. On the outsides? Yeah. A light, light sprinkle, like a, less than what you did before. Okay. Uh, Nick, are you good at accents? No, <laughs> the worst. You're not good at any accents? No. If you, if somebody was like, right now, okay, I'll give you a thousand dollars to do an accent, but it has to be like decent. What accent would you do? American, because that's what I am. All right, that's okay. Uh, you know what I mean, like something different than what you are. Uh... Cheater. I can't do any of that. I'm not good at any of that. Do a British accent. Hello. <laughs> Alright. 
that's all you get. Um, no, I, I, I never understand how people do accents. I think it's fake. I think I don't think people actually do accents. So there's definitely way too much dough on these, but you know it's fine. We're gonna keep going. Nick, if you could have a theme song for your life, what song would it be? Oh, like an existing song. That yeah, I an existing song that you choose that you would deem the theme the theme song for your life. What would it be? I don't know that many songs. Cool, we got our rolls. Wow, they're they're actually not looking that bad now that I've cut them up. Do they are they closed in? Like, is there like yeah, pizza? Okay. Is there it looks like a little cinnamon roll. Isn't it cute? Yeah, it is cute. Yeah, that's a lot of the Don't touch it. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is extra uh, carbs. Come on, Nick. We're we're about to run a marathon. We need our carbs. Um, how many help? That's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool thing. Yeah, song. I like that one. Yeah. All right, Chelsea. Like, so like pretty common answer though, but you know I'll take it. Let me update y'all real quick. We're putting these on a pan, gr lightly greased. All right, we're gonna put these all in here, spread them out, and then we're gonna go ahead and put them in the oven for 10 to 12 minutes. So let's go ahead and pop this in here. Did you use all the pepperoni you had? E no, you want some pepperoni? I mean, yeah. <laughs> no, I did not use all the pepperoni that I had. All right, let me set a timer for 10 minutes. All right, guys, so we got about a minute left on our pizza. In the meantime, we're gonna go and ask Nick his speed round of questions. Nick, are you ready? No. Okay. Go. Favorite ice cream flavor? Chocolate. Flavor, st flavor of Starburst? Uh, the red one. Cereal? Cocoa Fast food fries. Fries McDonald's. Breakfast food. Since you don't like breakfast. Uh, well, French toast or waffles. Dessert? Any dessert? Yeah. Cake? Boy band. No. Ooh. Cake. Uh, cake. Uh, boy band? Uh, boys to men. Favorite state? California. Car? No. <laughs> Tesla. Ooh, beach. There you go. Um, my favorite beach? I don't go to the beach that much. Olympic Huntington? sport. Um, so for winter Olympics, I love curling. Curling is so fucking fun to okay. watch. Okay. Um, and then for regular Olympics, um, I don't really care. I don't really watch that much. Favorite board game? Uh... Oh, this is a speed round. Oh my god. Yeah, you're over uh, here thinking. Oh my god, I don't know. I don't play. You board. got stuck. Like categories. All right, favorite nursery rhyme. Um, Mary had a little lamb. And last one, favorite place to meet up. The f what kind of question is that? Favorite place to meet up. The, the park. I don't know. All right, cool. I love the park too. How'd you know? <laughs> the more <laughs> videos yeah, there. How did we know? Where else do we go? All right, y'all. So that was Nick's speed round of all of his favorite items, except he got stuck for like 30 seconds on one. <laughs> I, I couldn't think of a board game. All right, so without <laughs> further ado, y'all, let's go ahead and take our pizza rolls out of the oven. Ooh, all right. <laughs> they look good. They, they look, um, they look like they're, they're nothing but go. <laughs> all right, I got one more question while I prepare this marinara sauce. Sure. If you could get rid of any state in the United States, what state would it be? Any of them? Yep, any state. Rhode Island, get it out of here. Why? It's too small. Alright, you heard it, Rhode Island. You're, you're no longer valid. Just merge it with one of the other states. Alright. So we got our final product of our pizza pizza items. Can you see them, Nick? Yeah, they look very doughy. We got our side of marinara sauce and our pizza rolls with extra dough because we're carving up for this marathon we're gonna run. Into one of these. I'm gonna bite into this one. This one looks the best. But look, he's still really hot though. Right. The middle looks really good. Sounds crunchy. Mm-hmm. They're not bad. They would be a lot better if I made them correct, but they're actually <laughs> like pretty good. Pure crust right there, right? Yeah, but like the little piece of pepperoni that I got, pretty good. Okay, good. Good cheese. Mm-hmm. Ooh. That's really good. If you like just the crust of pizza, that's the snack for you. You want one? Cheers. Yeah, cheers. Thank you. Yeah. But yeah, I think we're going to call it TNT with T. So thank you so much for tuning into this segment of TNT with T. I will catch you guys next Monday, Wednesday with another segment, a new interviewee. 
and we will kick that off. Let me know in the comments down below, guys, how you're liking these. Um, I, I think they're a cool segment. I think you guys might be liking them a lot, but I don't know. So let me know in the comments down below. Thank you, Nick, for being on this episode of TNT with T. I My promise pleasure. we will get you back in the kitchen for real once we're not supposed to be social distancing you anymore. You should do all the people that had to like FaceTime. You should just have them make it on their own because they watched you do it while you interview them. So you ready to make these pizzas? No, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, we might do I that. We might do that. that. Um, but you guys know the drill. If you like the video, leave a like down below, yo. It really helps me out. Subscribe to my channel for new content like this. Turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of these Sunday or now Wednesday uploads. And I will see you guys on Sunday with a new video. Peace out. Bye.